in this question we are going to solve a example which is using PC relative addressing mode. So let's read the question. Consider the following instruction sequence in a RISC machine. So this is the instruction sequence. Conditional and unconditional branch instructions use PC relative addressing mode with offset specified in bytes to the target location of the branch instruction. Further, the offset is always with respect to address of the next instruction in program sequence. If target of branch instruction is I, then what is the decimal value of the offset? If you remember, in PC relative addressing mode, what happens is that if there is any branch instruction, whatever is the branch instruction and the offset is given and this offset is added to the PC value to get the address of the next instruction that has to be fetched. So here they are saying that the target of the branch instruction is I. This is the branch instruction. If you look at the code, this is the branch instruction and the offset is given over here. The target of this branch instruction is I. That means after execution of this instruction, the next instruction has to be fetched from here, which is the address of instruction I. So how will we solve this question? If we take a look at the logical addresses of this instruction sequence, let us assume that instruction I is at address 0. Now this instruction is of size 4. That means I plus 1 would start at address 0 plus 4 which is 4 because 0 to 3, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 bytes it would require for instruction I. I plus 1 would start at address 4. Now I plus 1 is of size 3 that means I plus 2 would start at 4 plus 3 address 7. I plus 2 is of size 5 that means I plus 3 would start at address 7 plus 5 12. I plus 3 is of size 1 so I plus 4 would start at address 12 plus 1 13. Now when this instruction branch instruction is being executed the program counter is already pointing to the next instruction in the sequence which would be i plus 5. So what is the, going to be the address of i plus 5? Since this instruction i plus 4 is of size 3, i plus 5 would be at address 16. So the program counter is having a value 16. And what should be the value of, of the offset so that we fetch the next instruction from address of i. The address of i is 0. So whatever value is added to the program counter, it should re result in address 0. So if you see that program counter is already having a value 16, so the offset should be minus 16. This value should be added to the program counter so that the resultant is 0. So if minus 16 is one of the options given, then this will be your answer. If the sign is not being considered, then your option would be 16. So this is going to be the decimal value. Since they are just asking for the decimal value, they are not considering the sign, then 16 can be your answer that this is the value of the offset. So the program counter, which is containing a value of 16 plus minus 16 would give a value of 0. That means the program counter will now have 0 and the next instruction would be fetched from instruction i. That means the next instruction would be fetched from address 0 which is instruction i.